Paula Frenetti is a 67-year-old Pittsburgh native who had the honor of being a torchbearer for the torch ceremony to kick off this year's games. Paula is a passionate basketball player and a beloved member of her Pennsylvania team. Oh my gosh, that was a dream come true. Ever since I was a little girl, I, I was like mesmerized with the Olympics. I can remember being six years old, watching the Olympics. Every time the national anthem was played, I'd stand up, put my hand on my heart, and when the torch was raised, I just thought, what would it be like to be a torch bearer or you know, one of the people that lit the torch? When they asked me because of like, my whole story you know, to do this, I just like, I started to cry. It, it was just so phenomenal. It was a great experience. A couple of years back, Paula was in a horrific car crash that nearly took her out of basketball completely. I sustained seven pelvic fractures, five spinal fractures. Wow. I had internal bleeding. My bladder was punctured from the bones in the front of my pelvis. Wow. My lung collapsed, my diaphragm ruptured, I had a concussion. Like, you know, I shouldn't be here today. Paula was on track to recover after two years, but through her strength and perseverance, was able to make almost a full recovery after eight and a half months. So I understood the healing process, but it was the mental and emotional process that was the challenge. Right. Because when anybody goes through any type of like recovery, yeah. you, you know, healthcare is designed to create an intervention, right? right? And, and that intervention is to put the body back together. Right. But the recovery process is up to you, your mental outcome. Right. And I wrote a book about my process, you know, like, you know, the, the six principles that I kind of learned in retrospect, you know. Yeah, yeah. Really? And What's the book called? It's called Rebound Planner. Rebound it's based Planner? on the, the principle of basketball, you know, like with rebounding. We are grateful to see Paula's smile and energy back on the court.